So well, here we are again on the uh, one of the secret southern still waters trying to catch one of the big carp in the lake. Um, several thirties in here, uh, quite a few twenties so obviously I want to get a thirty but be quite happy getting a twenty. I have had a little um, sort of ten pounder when I first got here about my second cast and I've had a lot of lion bites three o'clock this morning I had an absolute steaming run got up lifted into it was sort of playing a fish for a while um, then went to move me right right out of the way and then just lost it um, three in the morning a bit of noddy angling going on because I originally picked up the wrong world when there was a run didn't even look at my receiver, I'll see the colour. Uh, don't know what's going on. I just picked up the right rod, thinking it was that one, struck into it, and it's still running, right and empty. Anyway, lost that one. Just hoping to get one soon. I'm getting a bit of interest. I've been baiting up um, one spot. My left rod has been continuously baiting a little spot, closing the margins every now and then. Handful of halibut pellet, um, and the odd cream baits tick a boily. And that's what's on my hook or on the hair and my right rod has been sort of out of distance had runs on that but I've, I've had sort of continuous runs so I just let it run and then I picked up to it nothing in it connected into nothing um, so I've now doing a similar thing on the right rod to where I'm on the left rod just in the margins three handfuls of halibut pellet um, every now and then I just get up and put a bit more in this is the issue. The swans. Go away! Keep like you once they disturb your line, I feel that, that pulls your hook. Right. Once they, you go away. Oh, bloody things. Too much bird life down here. That's what I'm using there, the old um, chicken tikka masala magic. Um, before I put them in the freezer, I put some rock salt in there and a little bit of Worcester sauce. And that's what I'm using with my hook baits. Looks like they do the trick. There you go. That's my hook bait, and that's in a catch carp PVA bag that I've made holes in so it sinks nicely to the bottom. You feel it fud on the bottom, and you know your bait's going to be in there nicely. So that's that catch carp PVA. Check it out online. And the old baits, the cream baits. You can check that. Check them out on Facebook or online if you're interested. Birds. 
Well, enough bird trouble. Thank you very much. <laughs> Not just of the feathered type. That's it. Go away. This is another fish. Could be a bit bigger than the previous one, I believe. ruining my fishing outing keeps coming in and doing me you know it comes right up to the rod tips no matter where you cast it just comes up and knocks in the rods bloody thing I've tried going to the next room and feeding it but it's relentless and it just comes back every time nightmare that Fortunately, I've managed to pick up the uh, a bream. It's a very large bream. Mm, should I weigh the bream? Oh, as well. Millie. 